Hello and welcome to Film Space with Tommy and George. My name is Tommy. And I'm George. We have many discussions about film. This is one of them. Nolan we've talked about, but Nolan would make a great film, but I don't think he'd make a great Star Wars film. Um, I... Because he's the kind of guy yeah. who like, he'd make his film. Who else has said no? Zack Snyder said no. Zack Snyder said no. Good, because um, that'd be a weird Star Wars film. I'd be fine with that. Would you? Um, uh, he doesn't have a hand in the script. I just wouldn't want, like, you know, lightsabers being <laughs> slow motion, fast motion. Oh, I don't know, I wouldn't like that. But yeah, <laughs> script. Oh. Yeah, if, like, I'm, I'm fine. Sucker punch. I'm fine with him doing anything as long as he's not near the script. So, yeah. uh, does that. Who Who else? Um, oh, I don't know. Has he got any projects, like, arranged for us? Uh, Man of Steel? Snyder. Snyder. Oh, I'm not sure. I don't think so. I don't think so. I'd, li- I'd like Andrew Stanton. To, um, Andrew Stanton. Andrew Stanton. He's another Pixar director. Right. Um, I can't remember precisely which ones he did. I think he did Wally and some other ones, obviously. Right. And uh, he had a big hand in all of them, I think. And he also did his first live action was um, now be careful what you do after I say this, John Carter. But okay. if you think about John Carter, first of all, the I, prob- don't, I don't hate that film. Yeah. Well, the problem most people have with it is because it's very sort of derivative. Like it's exactly the same as like loads of other things. But that book was written years ago. It was it? written a hundred years ago. It was written by yes, Ed- it was written by that. Edgar Rice Burroughs, the guy who did Tarzan. Yeah, so yeah, everything yeah. that all most science fiction come after that has taken from it. So by now it seems derivative. Like and it's very much a Buck Rogers sort of thing. That yeah. Buck Rogers was yeah, inspired yeah, by yeah, yeah, yeah. And George Lucas famously was going to do a Buck Rogers film, but he couldn't get the rights to it, so he did start oh, instead. Mm. So if you think if you look at um That's full John, circle, yeah, yeah, and if you look at John Carter, it is like it does feel a bit like a new hope, doesn't it? It feels yeah, like it feels like a sort of slightly pulpy science fiction thing. It's very, very classic. I can imagine yes. it being made like y- years exactly. ago. Exactly, like, like one of those old sort of like them. sci-fi That's serials. Story, yeah, yeah. So yes. that sort of that yeah. pulp, those pulpy sort of stuff, which I think could work for Star Wars, but if you're taking it back to basics, I don't know where I'd like to see Star Wars go. I mean, That's the thing. Like, after like. The prequel, like trilogy, right. it can only get better. I think so. Yeah, that's what I'm, that's, not, I'm not worried that's, about. That's, that's what people said. They're like, oh, it's like it can't be as bad as the prequels. Let's be fair. Um, or let's be a bit fairer. Can't be as bad as Phantom Menace. You know, I don't think you can make a worse Star Wars film than that. Yeah, you can. Attack of Clones. You can't. That's not that bad. It, what's it the, really what isn't. good part is there in like Attack of Clones? Many, such as. Uh, what, you, you even said the, the chasing. Yeah, that's okay. Very good. Yeah, that's okay, but then you've got Count Dooku fight was awesome. No, I hate oh, the whole oh. Yoda thing though. Yeah, that's the Count Dooku fight with Yoda. Yeah, but I meant with the one with Anakin and Obi. Well, that's kind of like, you get the yeah, I suppose. But very cool. Like the, oh, the, the, whole, the Yoda like, thing. Clone like war. That wasn't good at all, man. What do you think? Just a bit. There's lasers everywhere. There's dust. And it's, and too, no, it's too busy. It's too busy. You're too busy. It's far too busy. Your face is too busy. Um, I think it's too busy. Yes, she probably is. She's a very hard-working woman. To check your face. Um, but yeah, CG Yoda as well, like jumping around like some sort of frisky mm. rabbit. Don't want that. That's what. Yeah, like. I thought that was unnecessary. Yeah, I liked what uh, Blade Media said about Yoda. That in the prequel series, he should have been just someone that was mentioned mm. and like spoke up about. Like yeah. he's off doing amazing things. I really like that idea. Yeah, I've that never even crossed my mind. That it's yeah. a really like cool thing. Right. That maybe the first time we do meet him, he's actually an Empire. That'd be mm. quite cool. Yeah, that's worked. Yeah. But they didn't. But they didn't. So <laughs> yes. we had a puppet. We, we got, lift, we got CGI. We got a lift with what we got. So um, unfortunately, yeah. Well, but um, well, for the best news about the new Star Wars thing is okay. This uh, is, right. About people that aren't directing it, okay. George Lucas. <laughs> George, <laughs> <laughs> he's not. He's not. But they're working from his treatments that he wrote in the seventies. Yeah, the and 70s. he's still so, like serving as a consultant. Yeah, creative it? consultant and that, which I'm fine with. Perfectly fine with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I'm okay with that. I mean, the main three, I mean, Harrison Ford, Carrie Fisher, and Mark Hamill all came out and said we'd be perfectly yes. happy yeah, to yeah. have some sort of role in Episode 7 if it's needed. Personally, the only thing I would like from them mm-hmm. is like a surname. I'd like a Skywalker character, yeah, or a well, solo well, character, you most, know. Most people thought there was going to be like um, the Thrawn trilogy, like an extent in the um, expanded universe and stuff. Yeah. Stuff with Jason and. Um, Whatever her name is, um, Solo, because um, uh, they're, tw- they're twins as well. Yeah. Um, stuff like that, and Anakin, Sky- um, Anakin Solo, and that kind of stuff. Mm. Um, which, but I think they've come out and said that they aren't doing an expansion. There's a lot. Yeah, stuff. there's a lot of heavy rumours yeah. surrounding um, was like, doing a Jedi Academy on Yavin yeah, Four. Yeah, exactly. Like that, and having but... him in like the Messiah Temple, mm. and then having like Mara Jade Skywalker and stuff like that, which they may 
use that to um, inspire certain things, mm. but I don't think they. I think they've come out and said they're not actually doing adaptations of expanded yeah. universe stuff. At least not for the trilogy. That doesn't rule out any sort of Knights of the Republic film, which I'm so dying. I've for. read quite a few, um, like Django Fett. Yeah. Um, Dark Horse comics, oh, yeah. and they're like they're like really cool yeah. actually, and I'd like to see some, definitely some more bounty hunter stuff. Yeah, what 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 are they called? The oh I can't think of the name. There's like a thing for like what the, the bounty hunters are. That armor, it's like a type of armor. It's Mandalorian. Yeah. Ma- that's it. I was yeah. gonna say like Mandarin or something. Mandarin. <laughs> <laughs> the orange. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> uh, no, the Mandalorians, and yeah. obviously if you're not a public fan, you'll know a lot about Mandalorians because that was in post the Mandalorian War. Did you ever play the PS2 game? Uh, Styles Bounty Hunter. No, I didn't. It's very good. Yeah, it's very very good. Oh, I loved it. I'd love. I really like Django Fett and um, like Boba Fett, obviously. Yeah, so I'd love to see Boba some Fett more so. some Fett stuff. Some Fett. The Maybe Fett. like a between um, Attack of the Clones and uh, Empire Strikes Back. Honestly, Boba I don't Fett think, stuff. Yeah, I don't think they will. I mean, if I don't know, it's just you know, yes. a man can dream. It'll be too convoluted to like do that. I think like have this but set like there and but. Yeah, that would maybe be. I don't know. Mm. I don't think it would happen. <laughs> no, never. No, no. If I got the call, however, yes. If I got the call yeah. for a Star Wars film, that's exactly what. Yeah, it'd be. I mean, I'd, no, I would. I do. Um, I probably have. Um, you probably do nights, wouldn't you? I, I do. I do nights. I do nights in public. But if like it was seven. Would you nine, rather do seven eight nine, or a, your own thing? Well, my like, own in thing. The, universe? the pressure would be off doing my own thing in the universe. Yeah. But a part of me would like to do it, because I want to do, like, I like to have Kyle Katarn and that kind of stuff. If you've ever played the Jedi Knight games, or the Jedi Academy games, they're, they're really. very good. Um, and Kyle Katarn, is a, he was, I think he started, he started off as, like, a bounty hunter, a smuggler thing. He started off as a, as a member in the Imperial Army. Oh, okay. And then he became sort of a bounty smuggler, uh, working for the Rebel Alliance. And then he um, became a, begrudgingly became a Jedi then he gave up his, he disconnected himself from the Force, yeah. got it back, and he's sort of very much a reluctant hero, and sort of very sort of like wizened and cynical slightly. If I was given the call, yeah. and they said, you can do whatever you want for anything, oh. I would do prequel prequels. Prequel prequels? Yeah, have you ever read the books, uh, the Star Wars Jedi Apprentice? No. Set around Obi-Wan. And, oh, uh, right. So he's originally like in the Academy, I think I've got one, I can lend you. Okay, cool. And he's like in the like the Jedi Academy, and then uh, he's doing all the training stuff, yeah. and then like I think about halfway through the book, like Qui Gon like comes and mm. he becomes the apprentice, and it's just like all these really cool like missions they go on together. Yeah. It's really like interesting oh, nice. stuff, and like I th- love Obi Wan Kenobi. He's probably yeah. like my favorite film uh, character yeah. of all time as oh, well. Really? Yeah, I Lying really man, really yeah. love like, Obi Wan. Yeah. So and Hugh McGregor as well. So yeah. Can't uh, go uh, Alec Guinness. Alec Guinness. Yeah, and Hugh McGregor. Uh, 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 it's so out of Guinness. It's so out of Guinness, yeah. For a start. <laughs> <laughs> How dare you? How dare you turn this around and me not appreciating out of Guinness? He was, awesome. he was good in that film. He played voices that, that and the and terror and were suddenly silenced. It's out of Guinness. So out of Guinness. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're good friends, so I can call him out of Guinness. Oh. It's brilliant. Let's be calling him Al. Al. He's, he's, dead doesn't. Dead. he's dead. He's dead. <laughs> oh, I hope so. They buried him. <laughs> uh, and, and Bridge on the River Choir is awesome. But what was the film I'm trying to think of that he was in? Um, is Bridge on the River Kwai? No, it wasn't. One of the most famous ones. It's the one about the um, the British. Uh, uh, the, I can't think of the word I'm looking for now. You sure were. He was in the film. He was in, <laughs> he was the, in film. the film. He was in many films. Uh, you you just talk for a minute while I think of it. Okay then. <laughs> um, what? Not about not about Atticus though. <laughs> Is he? He's got a very strange expression on his face. Cool. About the British what? It was about the British soldiers in being held captive by the Japanese. No, it wasn't. Okay, then. You're thinking of the wrong war. Huh? You're thinking of the wrong war. Uh, am I? Yeah. I'm thinking of... Go a bit further back, then. What? Uh, you played the king. You played a king? You beheaded um, by Oliver Cromwell. Charles? Um, Charles. Yeah, it was Charles the first. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, medieval history scene. Yeah. Yeah, what was the film called? I don't know. Was there a film? Yes, there's a film <laughs> where he played Charles. I didn't he know. played King Charles the first. I, I don't know. He's beheaded. Alright, okay. Well he did, that's how he that's how he died. That's uh And then Charles II came in and <laughs> That was a total waste of like three minutes. That was terrible. <laughs> I, we could have gone further, right? Because first year drama theatre studies we did a restoration comedy and that was Charles II came back, opened up all the theatres and stuff. But it's not <laughs> let's, let's not get into that. It's not. Uh, um, we could talk about so much. We could talk about everything. It'll be like, and now we're doing history space. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, let's not lie. Let's not. 
That's not let's just keep it with film space. And actually, let's space. round up the episode. Right, there. okay, okay. Right, to sum up, I'm ridiculously excited about it. Yeah, a lot of people are very worried yeah, or I start, not excited. I, start, I, start, I am super excited. I started excited. off saying I was cautiously optimistic. I wasn't cautiously optimistic. Oh, every, I've been every, excited Every since time already. I meant to do it, every time I thought about it, I actually got... Sh- I physically shook. It was the, <laughs> I was that excited by it. Oh, I'm, I'm ridiculously it excited. Is. You can... Guarantee that I'll be at the premiere. Uh, so. Yes, exactly. We will. We, yeah, we yes. shall. Yes. <laughs> I stared at you very intently then. Yeah, you did uh, actually. I felt that. I know, right? <laughs> um, oh, by the way, also, um, uh, before um, late last year, it was announced that um, Kathleen Kennedy may be making an announcement about Star Wars sometime in January. So We're in January? We are in January. We're done. When was it announced? October? Um, I don't know. I can't remember I think now. it was October. Mm. I don't know. Yes, and also, um, someone posted on Twitter once... Um, I think he worked for Deadline, and there was like he had sources of information in that, and his tweet was, "Who says the main character will be male?" Mm. So tune in next. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, on that note, yeah, uh, thanks for listening. Yeah, and uh, be sure to uh, sort of just comment, say anything you like. Yeah, yeah. If anything you want, if you want to like. give anything you like to sort of like open up discussion forums, you know, say what you want to see in Star Wars, how you think about it, all that kind of stuff, and if you have anything you want us to talk about at all. Just, uh, just say that as well. Be sure to check out the site, the Facebook, yeah, exactly. the YouTube. I'm sure you're doing the YouTube. Yeah, because the, the Twitter, etc. All the, the news on the site. Yeah. www.geekspace.co.uk. Bam. Thanks so much for listening. Indeed.